He is known for being an early explorer of the present-day Australian states of New South Wales and Victoria. He is recognized for participating in an expedition that first took an overland route from Sydney to Port Phillip. He was part of an expedition of the first Europeans to find the Darling River. His name is Hamilton Hume. In the early 19th century, the vast and untamed lands of present-day Australia beckoned to the brave and the adventurous. It was during this time that Hamilton Hume, a renowned explorer, embarked on a series of expeditions that would forever shape the history of New South Wales and Victoria. Born on June 19, 1797, in Parramatta, New South Wales, Hume's insatiable curiosity and determination led him to explore the uncharted territories of the Australian continent. In 1824, Hume, along with William Havel, embarked on a groundbreaking expedition that would forever change the course of Australian exploration. Their goal was to find an overland route from Sydney to Port Phillip, now known as Melbourne. Navigating through dense forests, treacherous rivers, and rugged terrain, the intrepid explorers forged a path that would become known as the Hume and Havel Track. This arduous journey took them through the heart of the Great Dividing Range, crossing rivers such as the Goulburn and the Darling, and encountering the beauty and challenges of the Australian landscape. Four years later, in 1828, Hume joined forces with Charles Sturt on another historic expedition. This time, their mission was to explore the Darling River, a river of great significance to the indigenous people of Australia. Hume and Sturt became the first Europeans to discover and navigate this majestic waterway, unveiling its secrets and unlocking its potential for future settlement and development. Hamilton Hume's expeditions through New South Wales and Victoria had a profound impact on the world. His explorations opened up new possibilities for colonization, trade, and the expansion of European influence in Australia. The routes he and Havel charted provided crucial pathways for future settlers and explorers, shaping the growth and development of these regions. Today, the towns of Broadford, Wandong, M.T. York, and the picturesque Lithgow Valley bear witness to the footsteps of Hamilton Hume, reminders of the courage and tenacity of this legendary explorer. Hume's name stands tall among the great explorers of history, his legacy forever etched in the annals of Australian exploration. As we reflect upon the indomitable spirit of Hamilton Hume, we are reminded of the profound impact his expeditions have had on the world. His intrepid journeys have not only shaped the history of New South Wales and Victoria but have also inspired generations of adventurers and explorers. Hamilton Hume, a true pioneer, whose spirit of discovery continues to ignite the flames of curiosity and courage in all who dare to explore the unknown. At the age of 17, Hume embarked on explorations beyond Sydney, accompanied by his brother John and an Aboriginal boy. They ventured southwest as far as Barama, honing their bushman skills along the way. In 1817, Hume joined James Meehan and Charles Throsby on a journey that led them to discover Lake Bathurst and the Goulburn Plains. The following year, he embarked on another expedition with John Oxley and Meehan, reaching Jervis Bay. In 1822, Hume partnered with Alexander Berry for a journey along the south coast of New South Wales. They explored as far south as the Clyde River and ventured inland close to Braidwood. Barry later settled in the Shoalhaven region and, in June 1822, entrusted Hume and a team of convicts with the task of constructing a 209-yard canal connecting the Shoalhaven River and the Crookhaven River. Completed in just 12 days, this canal became Australia's first navigable canal and remains a vital waterway in the Shoalhaven River system. If you want to discover more adventurers on YouTube, make sure to hit that subscribe button for my channel, and don't forget to leave a comment in the section below, telling us which adventurers you'd like us to feature next.